Two stars keep not their motion in one sphere, nor can one England brook a double reign of Harry Percy and the Prince of Wales. Or shall it, Harry, for the time has come to end the one of us. And would to God thy name in arms were now as great as mine. Oh, I'll make it greater ere I part from thee. And all the budding honors of thy crest, I'll crop to make a garland for my head. I can no longer brook thy benefits. Imagined wing, our swift scene flies. In motion of no less celerity than that of thought. Suppose that you have seen the well-appointed king at Dover Pier. Embark his royalty. Oh, do but think you stand upon the rivage. And behold, the city on the inconstant billows dancing, for so appears this fleet majestical holding due course to our floor. Follow, follow, for who is he whose chin is but enriched with one appearing hair that will not follow these culled and choice-drawn cavaliers to France? Work, work your thoughts, still be kind, and eke out our performance with your mind. <laughs> 